That's right, we're gonna talk about some dead people. Or maybe dead people. Future uh, gonna die. I see t- jo- Johnny Depp. Johnny <laughs> Depp. I, I that's see my, dead people. That's my oh, dead. you suck. Defamation issues. Oh my gosh. All right, <laughs> this is a show. We're gonna get to it. We decided to invite our good friend, Mr. Sensibly Cynical, to the show, and that way we could talk about, we're going to try to make some money tonight. Noob Noob's got some ideas, I've got some ideas, Mr. Sensibly's got some ideas. We're going to talk about the death pool. Who would you put money on to die, and then what do the odds look like? Joe Biden. Oh, my God. <laughs> that sounds... Oh. Yep. So I, I'll maybe I'll do some Googling so we can see what the state of these people look like. Uh, mm-hmm. We cannot pick Bob Barker anymore because he is already dead. So he's mm-hmm. out of the death pool. He's very dead. I think it was like 95. 99. So like you'd only get a couple dollars for that. 99. Well, if we you pick somebody pick, who's 99... We can't, ter- we can't pick Terry Funk either. God rest his soul. Who the can't fuck is him. that? Who's Terry Funk? Oh wait, isn't he a wrestler, a WWE guy, <laughs> Terry? Funk. Yeah, the, the the guy, the guy who did hardcore matches at like age seventy. Oh my gosh! Nah. Yeah, that guy that should have picked Chris Jericho. Him. You would have got him and his family. <laughs> did wait? Is Chris Jericho? No, dead? Chris Benoit. Yeah, Chris no. Benoit. Oh my Chris, gosh! <laughs> oh, yeah, that yeah. I think that's across the line. <laughs> Bret Hart. Yeah, that, oh, that, he's yeah. still he's still alive. No, we he's, said, we should. Uh, oh, Bret Hart's, Hart's still alive. dead. Oh, uh, no, it, Bret Hart's dead no, too. No, it's, it's Bret Hart. No, Bret Hart's alive. Which one's the dead one? Owen Hart. Hold he's on, really old. We're gonna Owen. Google it. Owen Hart. Yeah. Oh no boy, I have the he's wrongs. the one that fell from the the yeah the catapult um, or whatever. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The catapult. No, you mean from the ceiling? Yeah, I don't know. He got catapulted. I mean, Bret Hart. Yeah. Yeah, Bret Hart's still alive. Better to go that way than... We'll see. I don't know if he is. Strangle your family. He is still alive. There you go. See, I'm going to fact check us Now look at Owen Hart, though. He's definitely dead. But did they look similar? Owen Hart had like a beard or something. Are they they like cousins? No, I think they're brothers. No, I think they're cousins. Oh, I could be wrong. There was a different... uh, uh, Who's the other guy? Jim the Anvil? Jim the Anvil Steel or something? Yeah, he died in 99. That was a long time ago. He's the brother, though, right? Uh, sure. Not sure. Uh, I don't know how to prove that. I how think did they the are, accident happen? Okay, anyway. Uh, Kansas City. Anyway, Oh, it's pay-per-view. Would you pay for that? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so... Would, oh, you got, would you guys Would you guys pay for a pay-per-view if it was Paris Hilton versus Lindsay Lohan? Are they naked? Didn't they have a death thing? They already had a death yeah. match of that. Well, like, they, they're the on day. my list, Z. They're Both on my list. Both of them? Yeah. I think those are terrible picks. You're not going to make oh. any money. That's like a thousand to one odds that they're going to die. No, what do you mean? Lindsay Lohan's pretty. She's Lindsay one Lohan. bad trip away. First of uh, all, she just had a baby. So she she's crashed. pretty alive. Listen, listen, she already crashed a Mercedes Benz. Yeah, but that was she's a while ago. Crash. Now she's yeah, a mama. So, and she, so? she's, What's your point? She's, got, a, she's got that oil money or something like that. She's no, dating she's like had, a Greek had, magnate. Yeah, but she had. Married. Uh, she had a uh, was it mommy issues, childhood issues. Who does those things? Those things stay, man. Preach. Well, she had a baby, don't so I, I don't think she's going anywhere anytime soon. She's from New York. That's a you know. Oh my gosh, she's already posting pictures of her baby. <laughs> oh my gosh, she's ugly. Oh, is fuck. she? <laughs> You're so rude. Holy shit! Look, that baby's all right. Look at that. Ba- that oh. looks like a face filter on that baby. I think they face filtered her baby. <laughs> Who's? So noob noob, who who's on your uh uh well list? what would do we have my girlfriend on there the uh, Demi Lovato <laughs> oh Demi Lovato yeah. that's a uh, she just changed her pronouns again so I think she's okay she's now hopefully dead no her pronoun is dead <laughs> how about she looks kind of wet here does that does that count yeah she looks you know at least mildly touchable there that's probably an older picture I'm that's gonna like say. the most touchable I can think she uh, uh like. Yeah, look at that manly, <laughs> whoa, whoa, fat whoa, whoa, Asian whoa. features. <laughs> whoa. whoa, so honest. Okay, so let's talk real odds on on um, Demi Lovato dying. First, to to make a hundred dollars, I think you'd have to put up like. I, I feel like you'd only make like I don't know twenty bucks get you a hundred. That that's one in five odds. What do you mean? That's like saying that? she has good odds to die. No, those are too good. Yeah. What about like 
a hundred to make a hundred? Is that bad odds? That's one to one. How does gambling go? I don't know. I don't know how to gamble. <laughs> Whose game was this? <laughs> Who's what betting about, Fazul's? Uh, yeah. What about Harvey Weinstein? Oh, oh, that's a real good one, but it's not. Is it Weinstein or Weinstein? It's whatever you want it to be. He's got the Jewish shekels. <laughs> oh, okay. you know the the film the film producer, him and his brother. Oh, I look mean... at him there with Gwyneth Paltrow. She don't look so happy. <laughs> oh yeah, she got oh. fucking plowed. I heard Brad Pitt went after him. So okay, he's like dying in prison. So the odds of him making it out of prison are pretty bad. Like. That's definitely you'd have to bet a hundred dollars to make fifty dollars. So that's like what two to one odds. Yeah. What's uh What's Dick Van Dyke's? How old is he? Who the hell is Dick Van Dyke? Okay. Well, you don't know who Dick Van Dyke is? No. I was gonna look up Dykes, but (laughs) Dick Van Dyke. No, no. You don't know who? Who's Dick Dick Van Dyke? From the Dick Van Dyke show? Sure. Who's this chick with the big boobs? Come on, Dick Van Dyke show. I'm not 50 years old. Yes, oh, he's 60 years old. He's too old for this. He's older than the Dick Van Dyke show. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not 75. I was not born in the 70s. Like I don't know what's born in the 60s. You didn't watch. Hold on. You didn't watch Nick. uh, Was it Nick at Night? No, I had money. I played video games. Like Pong, right? Yeah. Z, Z, do you know what Nick at Night was? I've heard of Nick at Night, yes. Nick at Night, I don't know if it's still around, but for those that are in Gen Z, Nick at Night was a, I think it's still around, like TV Land, where they would play old-ass shows on reruns. Well, just to give you an idea, right, Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, can you guess what year that came out? 37. (laughs) 1968. And Mary Poppins, you know when that came out? 42 1964 back in the war days. those are his two those are his two big big movies back right when chitta chitta bang bang you know what that means right i think that is from <laughs> cheech and chong the carol burnett show he was on that apparently women didn't get their own shows back in the 60s sure they did <laughs> back in the 60s was it, a cooking it was show? 67 to 1978 that was a long-running show was it a cooking show or about- no it was about carol burnett and how she should be birthing children? <laughs> no, I think she had a very Dick successful Van Dyke job. Was, was one of the like OGs, man. So if he's ninety-seven, I'd say he has a year or two left. Oh, he's still he's alive. Lucky. Yes, he Good is. Yeah, him. that's that's why I'm thinking. Look at how on, handsome like, he was. Back of those DSLs. My God, <laughs> oh. he was a handsome man back in the day. Look at him opening those mouths wide. Okay, wow. so <laughs> I know why he's vibrant. So, like I said, you you wouldn't. Uh, that's a that's a losing bet, though. His like, name says it all. You only you don't you'd make like fifty cents if you bet a hundred dollars. But yeah, like anyone in their nineties is kind of a cheap. Yeah, it's a cheap bet. You got to go young. Young and reckless is where you're going to make your money. So, young, ripe, and delicious. Young, do you agree with my Johnny Depp? Uh, oh, God. So you think the only way Johnny Depp dies, I th- Johnny Depp's rotten Do you want to see Johnny Depp's rotten teeth? You can't see this sensibly, but I can look this up. What's his? What What do you think his? <laughs> you think it's a? You think it's a risky bet? Jesus, are they actually that rotting? Yes. The only way that he dies is if uh, what's her face <laughs> kills him, Amber, answer, clearly, Amber. or he gets psoriasis of the no, not of the liver. No, what's the what's the thing where your teeth rot out of your head and you die from it? I don't know. Sepsis. No, that's not it. So you don't think there's a chance that Amber Heard plots out some evil um, redemption plot? That is far fetched, but it's, that is possible. I think that's a good bet. I think if you took that bet, you could like if you bet a hundred bucks on that, you probably win a thousand bucks. That's what I would say, right? I a hundred to one odds. I mean, didn't the whole thing? The whole thing came out uh, like during court, right? The whole Deb suit for fifty million dollars. I mean, that's a lot of money. She won, like no, he won money back, didn't he? I think so, and she's not going to be able to pay it, or maybe yeah. she did. She was pay supposed it. to donate her winnings that's to my, charity. That's and my then... reasoning: is that it's the ultimate revenge for Amber Heard in an unfortunate circumstance. I don't think she. C- I think it's a good bet, but not likely. Like that's a. Th- I think that's a thousand to one. I'm just more so like, what happened hey, to his teeth? They go won. big or go home. Good point. Good point. Uh, what's another one of our good ones? Uh, Amanda Bynes. Oh, there you go. We have we have we have an ace up our sleeve though. Amanda Bynes. I yes. want to hear this one. Uh, you mean you didn't realize that they found her walking around naked uh, in the streets in L.A.? You didn't hear about that? I've been busy, Z. Oh, Tell okay. me the story. Tell me the story. 
Uh, so apparently, Amanda Bynes, who's Fuck, who's she got so ugly. She has a uh, like a cr- like a crackhead boyfriend, and apparently they were supposed to be clean, but then things got a little weird. She was walking around naked on the streets of L.A. and knocked wow. on a door, like somebody's car door, and was like, "I need help. Take me to the police." And then they they. Uh, what do they call that? Where they involuntarily commit you, like a sixty-one, sixty or something? A three hundred two? No. Uh, because they because she had a conservatorship. Let's see what TMZ has to say. TMZ ventures outside. Oh my gosh! See, even oh if you saw God. her naked, would you? You wouldn't even want to see that. No, I, I'm not sure I'd need that. Yeah, I, I don't think so either. But a hole is a hole. Oh, good lord. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she used to be like a real like. Look at her. Yeah, she, she used, used to be, to be legit. Attractive. Yeah, I don't even think you're that desperate, noob. Well, he is. Well, holds a hole. I think it's a sixty-one sixty. She still got those. Uh, she's got the the residuals from some of her movies. So you know, pop it in, put a baby in her, take the residuals. You're, you're good to go. You think she gets residuals? I would think so. Involuntary. How else is she paying for shit? Commit. Ooh. Uh, how, how do you think she's paying for like her crack and all that stuff? I would assume mouth and residuals. Oh, a three hundred two. I guess it's a three hundred two. I said three hundred two. Okay, well there you go. Noob noob wins. Yeah, I know my mental health. Yes, yeah, she got three hundred two. I guess. Cause I be a doctor. You be a doctor, <laughs> obviously. So okay, that's ours. I would say odds on that are, who I, I they're not as good as Johnny Depp's. Like you wouldn't win as much money. Maybe five. You if you bet a hundred bucks, you'd win five hundred. What do you think? She's half the age of Johnny Depp. So you think her odds are... Yeah, but Johnny Depp's more likely, less likely to die. She's more likely to die. But like an overdose? She's like right there on the cusp of of like, she's on death's door. I think that's a good bet. Do you think that's not a good bet? It's probably the best bet we got. All right. I got a sleeper, Z. Go ahead. Don Don King. Don King. Is that the weird guy with the white hair? 88, already convicted with manslaughter. He No, he's black. Oh, my God. What? What's that? Well, you don't he... know who Don King is? He... Wait, there's only one black king, and that's LeBron. No, this is Don no, King. Don, Don King is one of the greatest boxing promoters of all time. Yes. He, he, was... promoted, he promoted the Thrill in Manila. Um, Mike Tyson. Muhammad Ali and Joe Frazier. And he killed somebody? George Foreman. Yeah. His he wife? Got, he, he got pardoned. Oh, he got pardoned in nineteen in the sixties because he he was charged with killing two people. Oh my God, he killed two and people! I didn't know that. Charged, man. charged, never proven. I believe that. I believe that is the. He was convicted of mo- voluntary manslaughter for stomping one of his employees to death. But- <laughs> Holy snikes! <laughs> but That's a bad justi- man. They said it was justifiable because somebody uh, was. You know, going for his Nick, take, house or whatever, he was protecting. So he's allowed to stomp someone, an oh employee. God. Did he have a? He have his. He's charged with gambling. He had a gambling issue. He's charged with killing two people. So one was they were thirteen years apart. One in nineteen fifty four, King shot a man in the Don back. King is yeah. Don King's on my list for it, sure. After spotting him trying to rob one of his gambling houses, that was justifiable yeah. homicide. And then in 1967, he was convicted of voluntary manslaughter for stomping one of his employees to death. He served yep. three months, three years and 11 months for that. Uh-huh. Uh, I'd say he's too old. Like that, you wouldn't make any. Like people would expect him to die soon. People don't even know who he is. What do you? Oh, get out of here! He's, oh, come oh, he's on, he's hugely dude. famous. Boxing is stupid. Don King is stupid. Do you want to hear our like last? Now LeBron great- James is the real king. Oh, Cos- what if you bet Bill on Cos- LeBron James' on. kid? No, oh, Bronny. Oh, hey, Bronny. Z, is, is Bill Cosby on your list? Oh, that's a good one. Yeah, no, he's not on my list. Isn't but he like 85? Yeah, you keep picking all these old people. They ain't going to make you any old money. Old rapists. <laughs> you old, old rapists. Sure, maybe I'm just copping out. Uh, how old is Cosby? Cosby's 8 million eight. years old. No. not You know, he's still old enough to get it in. He is 86 <laughs> years old. Yeah. yeah. So I would say, like, that's another bad one of like he's he could die any day. That's not a good like, but of old <laughs> age. I gotta I gotta pick one that you gotta find somebody young and right. You don't think you don't think Lindsay Lohan is a good pick? That was no, one of my originals. she's clean and she had a baby. No, I, I think she'll die. 
Before Bill Cosby? No, no way. Oh, no. Okay, th- I would say Lindsay Lohan's odds are like 5,000 to 1. What like, if, that's a huge What if in shot. five years her baby just grows up to murder her because she's a terrible mother? She'd still be too... That's like the kid would be too small to murder her. You got to give him 10 years. No. And then that's a bad bad investment. Bad investment. Pa- you know, Paris Hilton? Another terrible investment. She did not have her own baby, so I'm going to say that that will help her live longer. She's... Ripe, abused, alcoholic. Forty-two. She but, just had a baby too. You think that a new mom is gonna is she had gonna a baby at forty-two? No, she. Someone else had her baby. Oh, I was gonna say that's gonna be a because she's scared well, didn't of she, hospitals. Didn't she used to date? She used to date Nick Carter. Did she so, really? Oh, he. Uh, see, that would have been a great Nick pick. Car- Nick, what, Nick Carter, Carter? would have made you big money. Big money. Wait, Very Nick young. Because Aaron yes. Aaron Carter's no longer with us. No, Aaron. Carter's oh, Aaron dead. Carter would have made you big money. Cause he's yeah. he he's he's as good as my last pick. How old was he when he died? He was. Uh, they don't tell you. He was born in eighty seven, died in twenty two. One of my one of my friends actually interviewed him for her podcast. Was Aaron he Carter. still alive when she did yeah. that? <laughs> yeah, he was dying as she <laughs> was being interviewed. No, well, was... remember he died in the tub. What a way to go. Yeah. So he was he turned independent. He got way off the uh like the map as far as um, living. Like well no, well yeah, now but I mean <laughs> he lost his label, he had to go independent and he was just grasping at straws musically and toward the end. But Nick Carter, what's Nick he was Carter? 34. He's in sync. Nick Backstreet, Carter's he, yeah. Backstreet Boys. No, Backstreet Boys. Yeah, he's not going anywhere. They're I think they're making a comeback, aren't they? They never left. <laughs> <laughs> so how dare you? Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, if you would have picked a thirty-four-year-old, maybe yeah, you would have won big money. And well, and I'm drowning. Not, I'm not good at. I'm not good at this game. Apparently. Well, you you pick somebody who. No, you pick people that are gonna die real easy, but <laughs> yeah. you just won't make a lot of money. Yeah, you just won't make it. So far, we'll make more money than yeah. you. That's what it looks. We may like. lose more, but we'll make okay. more. Okay. All right. You want to hear our Can, last well, killer? I got, here's my last pick. All right, you go. Kim Jong Un, what the fuck? Kim Jong Un, <laughs> Kim Jong Un. That's I think that's a terrible pick because you he could just replace himself with a with a fake, and you would you never think, know. You don't think that he's gonna, you know? He's got the greatest health care money can buy. Also, does anyone know how old he is? He's thirty nine. Thirty eight. Thirty eight. Well, he's he was thirty eight on his website. Maybe There's he no just turned thirty nine. What's he gonna die of? Um. You got to call it. Uh, death by poison. poison. I don't what? want to say the word, but. Poison? He won't do it yeah. to himself. He's not going to. Why would he off himself? He has a great life. Or somebody, somebody's going to plot an attack. This oh. man is only 38 years old. 39. How when, how, when did he become in power? Uh, I guess the past, what's it been, in 12, 10 years maybe? I don't know. A while. What the hell? He was in his 20s when he, when he was a dictator? Yeah, so that means his, I don't know how. Uh, well, his, I'm on. I'm in 2011, on Ranker. his dad died. Yeah, I went on Ranker.com and he's on the list of people who on are likely Ranker. to die. Yeah, they got, he's got 294 votes this year. Uh yeah, those are all fool. I think that's that's it's a wild card for sure. <laughs> it's a wild card. I mean, his sister could take him out. Kim Young Jong, Kim, Kim Yo Jong, is she hot? Here's Kim Yo Jong. He's on Yo the list Jong. with the 80, He's on the list with like a bunch of eighty-year-olds around him. Kim Yo Jong, his sister. She's thirty-five. <laughs> you taking her out to brunch? No, I would brunch her up. I think, I think somebody. I think somebody's gonna gonna. Um, Who's this? Go on a go on a mission to vanquish him and succeed. I'd say I'm going with. Uh, who's this? Oh, that's his wife. Look at that piece, Re Sol Ju. <laughs> That's it. That's the that's the the uh, what's his name? Supreme Leader's piece. That's his oh piece. That's his main. All right, piece. So those are my you... picks: Kim Jong Un, Don King, Paris Hilton, Lindsay Lohan, Johnny Depp, and whoever else I said. We said I three. Goddamn it! Yeah, you picked like eighteen people. You're like, I, I hope one of them dies. <laughs> How, yeah, see, that's I... terrible for you to say that. All right, do you want to yeah. hear our our top pick? Our number one numero right. uno. Yeah, I can't count, noob. That's why I picked five. I can't count. I'm Bam. Like, Margera. Oh, not Britney that, Spears. No. Oh, from, well, we can, we can go with her too. But is that Jackass? Yes. He's 43 
And he just That's actually a good pick. He just checked out of rehab for the twelfth time. For the twelfth time. And it, last time he went went out like crazy he went out, his uh brother was like, uh my brother's in LA doing drugs. Can someone find him before he dies? So I think that's that's the hot pick. Although who would have picked Priscilla Presley? Oh. Anyway, yeah, Bam Margera. That's bam, bam. Pick. I think that's a solid pick. It's but he's forty. You don't think you don't think Steve O's gonna go first? No, Steve O's clean. Steve O's got a great podcast. <laughs> he does. Yes, he does. Her, Paris Hilton does too. No, her podcast is she probably <laughs> does it like once in a she's probably like uh who's the princess that you like so much? What? Who's Me- the princess? Meghan Markle? Yeah, the one who faked her interviews and like her podcast was terrible. Yeah, from Suits? Yes. Meghan she, Markle. Yeah, she had a fake podcast that didn't actually do any of the work. So it got canceled. Yeah. Spotify paid her like twenty million dollars yeah, to do she's nothing. She's a piece of shit. So Z, I have an idea. Yes. Whoever whoever has the better list, you know, if if an unfortunate circumstance happens to one of our picks, we should make we should make a free kind of t-shirt. Um, a deal. Yeah, t shirt deal. Like the one that Noob is wearing, I'll send you a, I'll send you a shirt, Z. It can't be burnt orange though. Pick another color, like Whatever green color, or how about black? <laughs> no. Black on black. Orange is the best color. I want black and on black. <laughs> or gray. Orange man red, baby. Listen, if I win, I get the Noob Noob pillow I've been wanting for a while. Oh my god! I think we can. Well, I don't know if we can make it. But we'll try. Wasn't it stolen from us? Noob, your girlfriend can make one of those pillows. She can sew her own she pillow can. right for you. I'll put <laughs> her in the pillow going. and send her. Is that a deal? Is that a deal? Shirt versus pillow? Yes, we can do that. We'll figure something All right. out. All right. Only handshake. if you promise to sleep handshake. with it. Virtual handshake. handshake. What's uh? You want to hear? That our... didn't look right. That looked kind of like uh, not right. Uh, well, right, he's not it. doing anything, you, and you can only see him. <laughs> There's his virtual handshake. He took you. <laughs> he was taking all of it for you. We have one. Swallowing do you want to pick deal. one more? Who's who's that older? Like I'm handy. I'm doing a handy to the podcast. Yes, that <laughs> is Britney Spears. Now she's mid 40s She's probably like 45. You think she's older than Bam? She's younger than Bam. I don't know if I believe that, but um. Oh yeah, Britney Spears would be a good one. Yeah, she's definitely losing it for sure. We were gonna. Oh, that, we I'd were gonna still hit it. You were gonna do her omelet. I you were gonna do, make the Britney Spears omelet. I would do her and give her an omelet. She's single, ready to mingle, dude. Yeah. She's got a whole harem of dudes. What I, about what about Christina? No, if Christina's not pick, going that's a anywhere. Pudgy fat bitch, I ain't touching that. Oh my god, <laughs> she's too. F- I thought no, she I'm, no. Oh my gosh, hold on. Can we show this on air? Can I? Uh, can I? Can I do this? Can I get away with it? With what? Christina, you're not going to be able to see this sensibly, but what you should do is Google Christina Aguilera Hulk outfit. Hulk? F O L K? Hulk. Hulk. Like oh, the Incredible Hulk. Hulk. She dressed yeah. as the Incredible Hulk. <laughs> Can you really? see what I'm, she's. I'm Googling that now. <laughs> Holy. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> That you, shit's crazy. Do you see what she's got? That's like that's like that's like some BDSM shit. Yeah, but do you see what she's got dangling between her legs? Y- yeah, I see that here. Sh- you see, she has like Ma, a dude. six foot. No, how long is that? Like a four? F- I don't know. It's a dangling, dangling. Yeah, she's got a big old dangling. She just amorphized all of her fat <laughs> into a giant penis. Dude, dude. dude what happened to her? <laughs> That's a good question. Yeah, she let the genie out of the bottle too <laughs> much. And she did. Oh my gosh, look at these pictures, dude. Oh my god. That's, Is she It's she, bejeweled. I don't know for, how long I can get away with that. Was that for Pride Month? Uh, who kn- yes, it was for LA Pride. Yeah, like click yeah. on some of the ones that like under the t- bottom left, second one. Bottom left here? Yeah. Like she used to be so attractive. And then she grew a uh eight inch dong. Uh-huh. And then she just kept eating. <laughs> look, she's a genie in a bottle. I know. Look. I used to like her better than Britney Spears. And how oh how I was well, I'm wrong on both cases, but oh gee. Oops, those I pants did it look, again. Oops, those pants look like they're trying to escape. Oh my god. Oh my word. All right. Oh, uh, I think we we just burned everybody's eyes out. We've seen <laughs> enough. Yeah. We have ruined anything. So we have a bet. Uh, if if the audience wants to get in, let us know. Tell us if our odds are wrong. They probably are because we don't know how to bet. 
We need a real sports better who wants to come on with us and help us set the odds for this game because the stakes are high. Noob noob pillow? Mm-hmm. Is it a full body pillow? Just regular size pillow? Just a regular size pillow that I. You sure you don't um, want a full size body pillow? No, that I, that I can help uh, relieve my, you know, some tension, a little bit yeah. of stress. Do you just want me to come fly to you and we can cuddle for a night? Yes. Uh, from he's willing from to fly Pens- anywhere. So from, yeah. from Pennsylvania to Florida? Florida. Yeah. Yeah, he's just not allowed to go into the Lake Erie area. We can go. We can go see base Florida man. Together. Are you? Do you have any warrants? Just make sure that you're That's like. That's important. <laughs> <laughs> they might come make, knocking on your door. Make sensibly. sure you run. Make sure you should probably run your record just to clarify. Before Nothing you a little leave. alligator sex can't help. Oh my god! Crocodile sex, alligator sex. Which one's which? Like, like, um, like. What's the level where it's like the most uh, intense background check possible? What's it? Level three. What's the level where it's like strict? I don't know. I don't know. All I know is that Chris that Hansen up. keeps calling us for an interview, and he wants to interview <laughs> Noob Noob. Yeah. Uh, I'm concerned. Back- background check. You should get a background check first <laughs> on all these people. Oh, my God. On, on Noob Noob. No, I, I want to come yeah. fresh and unchecked for you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, for oh boy. For, J- for Jenna. So, oh, can, so Jenna, Jenna did the spider. I was going to have Jenna on the podcast. Jenna, your but cat. She did the, yeah, your she puss. did the spider. She was Spider Kitty again. Oh my gosh! Well, she again does not make an appearance on the crossover podcast. It will, ha- it will happen. It will happen. It's one very sad. one night where she's not Spider Kitty, she's not feeling being a podcast host very much. I tried, but she's she's um, using my pet fee, you know, money at least. Well, why don't you tell everybody who, where you can listen to the Sensibly Cynical podcast so that we all, all know right. these things. Sensibly Cynical can be found wherever you get your podcasts. Um, Apple, Spotify, Stitcher, Spreaker, Blue, Blue, what is it, the blue one? I don't know, but a bunch, Blueberry, a bunch of them. Just, just Google Sensibly Cynical. Bonfire.com has all the merch. Instagram, Sensibly Cynical Pod. And Instagram X X is cynical sensibly and we're on um what's the new one what's the new one truth threads, social threads threads we're on threads oh you're too. on threads Sensi- sensibly cynical yeah we don't have time and to be on threads thank you thank you noob and z for having me on again it's always it's always fun Always, always fun. Even though, even though I I half ass it all the time, you guys still have me back on, so I appreciate that. Oh, I'm half asleep all the time. We so. yes, we we did the hard <laughs> work, bedtime. the heavy lifting. It's not. Yeah. It is past his bedtime. It is yeah. 10 p.m. It Eastern is, Standard Daddy Time. Is tired. Well, it's nine. It's nine. It's nine thirteen my time. Oh, you're in a different time zone. Yeah, I'm in Central. Oh, okay, look at you. Did not know. Miss Nomer. Not all of. Not all of. That's a big. That's a big miss. Um, misunderstanding or most people think that every every place in florida is eastern that's not the case i'm in the, the panhandle of florida from tallahassee to um pensacola is central then then everywhere else is eastern. my girlfriend's gonna be in pensacola next week there's two things i know about florida three things now one is that his girlfriend will be there ripe and ready mm-hmm. second is that there are alligators and and third, that there is a Florida man rad who hangs out down there. Based Florida and, man. And, Based Florida and, man. And four, it is the home of the best podcast out there, Sensibly Cynical. Obvious. There you go. Obviously. Best, so though? that's the fourth. That's Check the fourth. it out. We will catch everybody. I inter- yeah, I interview everybody, including right, Noob Noob, se- including Noob Noob, seven times. I don't know if it was seven times. Or Z, but... Z, you're seven times. I'm you're the, the king. No, I will, we're, you're going to do a joint interview, me and my girlfriend, me and Noob Noob's girlfriend. Oh, Z, good Lord. That Z, sounds terrible. And she can just peg Z, me. Z, you the have the record She'll just of peg. most. Z, you have the record for most sensibly cynical uh, podcast appearances. How honored are you by that? I am honored. I am the master. I have the record. Yeah, his suck. I have the record for most useful and good <laughs> Fuck. podcast appearances. I, I, we just want to see the one where you get pegged. That's all we're looking for. Yeah. Anyway, right. I guess that wraps it up for us. Say goodbye to the folks. We're out of here. We're on to the next one. <laughs>